everyone. How are you doing this morning? It's Marla. Hopefully everyone is doing well. Have my big mug of coffee <laughs> and I thought I would do a very, very quick follow-up video on my hair because I was kind of looking at my hair this week and thought, you know, this is something I should make a video about. I started using some hair products on my hair, especially in my temple area. That's where genetically my mom in particular had a little bit more thinning hair. The rest of her hair was super thick, but I had noticed that when she used to pull her hair back, I could see kind of thinning temples. I started using Jamaican black castor oil on my temples. Probably did it about once a week. And I've also been using another hair serum just mainly on that area. Also, I'm going to show you the two things that I've used. And then I'm going to show you kind of a before and after. And this is pretty close now to, I would say eight months of use, maybe eight months of using this. The last follow-up I did was at six months. This is going to show you at eight months. This is just the application of these two products. So let me grab them really quickly because I forgot to bring them out here. And then I'm gonna show you the before and after pictures. So the two products that I've been using are mainly, number one is this 100% pure and organic Jamaican black castor oil. I get mine from a company called Levin Rose. I'll put a link to it down in the description box. I've been using this for the entire eight months. I put about a a dropper or maybe a half a dropper just in my temple area and rub it in and just let it soak in there probably for about four or five hours if I can at night and then I wash my hair at night and rinse it out. The other thing I've been using is this BY which is Better Not Younger Super Power Fortifying Hair and Scalp Serum. Really like this. When this is used up I'm definitely going to buy another one of these bottles. So these are the only two things I've been using on that temple area and I'm going to show you now what my before and afters look like and when you look at the before and after I zoomed them in really close the before picture is going to be a little bit blurry the reason being is my actual footage that I had of my temples before I started this whole thing which is almost a year ago I deleted from my computer because I didn't think I was going to be doing any more follow-ups on my hair so what I did was I went back to one of my old videos took my iPhone and kind of filmed the part of the video of me showing the temples. So that's why the before is going to be not quite as clear as the after, but you're definitely going to be able to see the difference. I definitely plan on continuing this hair regime. So along. I'm going to show you a before and after picture of my temple area. That's the area I've really been working on with the castor oil. And I think you can see the before picture is on the left that there has been growth in that area using the black castor oil. You can see all those little hairs growing in there and a lot of the bald area has little hairs finally growing in it. This is the one side of my hair and this is also the other temple now and you can see yep I have hair growing in there too. I am really thrilled with the results I've gotten so far. The one other thing I wanted to mention that I've been using all over my hair on my temple area is the this little gadget that I got off of Amazon. It's uh, made of silicone, I think, soft little kind of teeth on it. I use it actually to massage my scalp. I use it when I'm shampooing my hair. It really does a great job of massaging my scalp. It gets the circulation going and at the same time it helps to distribute the shampoo all over my head. You're going to see this gadget in a face favorites video that I have coming up. I have loved this gadget so much. It has a little thing on the back that you can hold it with so you can get a really good grip on it. You can massage all over your head and I really think that this can help with your hair growth because it stimulates the blood circulation in your scalp. I really think it helps my scalp health, gets all the blood flowing all over my scalp and this gadget has been one of my favorite purchases off of Amazon. I'll 
will put a link to this down in the description box in case anyone is interested. So that is my update on my hair. It's probably been almost close to a year, probably eight months now. Definitely thrilled with the black castor oil and I am now starting some hair supplements. So we'll see if that can add any more benefit to what I'm already getting with the black castor oil. Hope you enjoyed this hair update. Take care. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye from Marla.